Hey everyone, it's been almost three months since Cosmo RNA, the first ever approved hair loss treatment since 1997, have been released into the market and some of the results and personal anecdotes have been starting to pop up on the internet. So in this video, we're going to be reviewing some of those and discussing their legitimacy. But before that, I want to share some really good news with you guys. It's something that I've been working on for the past couple of weeks and it is finally here. You guys can now book a 40 minute call or meeting with me online. The thing is, I've been in the past couple of weeks noticing an increased number of emails that I've been receiving and comments in the comment section where you guys send me your problems or maybe your individualized case of hair loss and I cannot really address those for two reasons one because I can't really afford the time to do so it takes a lot of time to read those emails and respond to them individually and secondly often one comment or one email doesn't 100% describe the case or the problem you're having so now in this 40 minute consultation or meeting service, you can have a 40 minute call with me where you can in full details describe to me your specific type of hair loss, your history of hair loss, and we, me and you can come up with a customized plan to maintain slash get back the hair that you've lost in the long term. This is not a short term solution, it's a long term, it's all about strategy. You can also ask me about any future hair loss treatments or their mechanism of action and the release date for each and every one of them because that's one more question that I've been receiving more often on my channel. And you can also have the opportunity to be featured on one of my future videos on this channel. So you can, if you wish to, share your specific hair loss journey and pass the message that you want to be passed on this channel and you will be featured on here. And of course, this service would not be free. Uh, I would charge a small fee for this 40 minute call, but after you pay this one-time fee, you will have unlimited follow-up emails with me where you can send me any requests or follow-up questions after our 40 minute meeting. So you can find me always available on email after our, again, 40 minute session. So that's regarding the good news. I've been working so hard on this and I'm so excited to share this with you guys. And I really hope that this meeting, this 40 minute session with me won't only be about the scientific questions and the individualized plan that we will make for your specific type of hair loss, but also to give us a more of an opportunity to bond with you guys and to have a closer relationship and to also vent to each other about hair loss. And uh, you will find me a good listener in this particular topic because I am a sufferer of hair loss myself. So uh, with that being said, let's jump back to the video. So the first case that I wanted to share with you about Cosmo RNA's results is this one. And to be honest, this is the most legitimate among all the results that I could find on the internet. And also the one that has the best lighting and the best conditions in terms of the length of the hairs in the before and after pictures. And as you can see, there is noticeable difference. In only eight weeks, this user is claiming the results is only in eight weeks of using Cosmo RNA. And he also is claiming that he experienced zero side effects. So uh, how legitimate is this particular personal anecdote? Well, uh, unfortunately, I don't think you should consider this as a real result for one reason, the camera angle. If you can focus on the back area, the vertex, sort of where the circle pattern of the hair is, you could see that in the after photos, the angle is a little bit changed than the before photos. And that can make a little bit of an illusion that will make the hair in the after pictures look somewhat more dense. So I wouldn't necessarily think that this after picture is a real one. So this one, I will give it a pass. And jumping up to the second case, this one have been posted by a user by the name Charmin Lawyer, which is a creative Reddit username to come up with, to be honest. But this particular post does not include any photos. There's just here a written review from the user about his three month experience with Cosmo RNA. And in short, he says that he is way below baseline. Not just it didn't work, but his hair loss progressed the fastest during Cosmo RNA use. And I've saw some users who indicated that he might be experiencing a shed, but a shed after three months is a little bit suspicious about 
um, or should make you a little bit suspicious about how well the drug is really working. So the second case is also a pass in terms of the efficacy of Cosmo RNA. And the third case is the one that received the most upvotes on the Cosmo RNA subreddit, which is a horrible subreddit, by the way, I'm going to talk about it in just a minute, but I just wanted to indicate that this case is the one that received the most hype just because of the incredible result that it seems to deliver. While I seem to have a little bit of a different opinion, these are close-up images, so you wouldn't really know if the lighting angle or the other conditions are well maintained between the uh, before and after pictures, but one indication is the color of the hair, not in the target area that he's targeting to photograph, but in the other areas. And you can see in the before and after pictures, and I'll make sure to put it clear on the screen, that the color of the hair is changing. And that's a big sign that the lightning is different from the two pictures. So uh, I would also give this particular personal anecdote a pass and reject it as a legitimate before and after picture for the Cosmo RNA efficacy experiment. Now, while you're watching me on your screens, maybe you're watching me on your TV or maybe on your phone while eating lunch or dinner, by the way, uh, I'm, I've always been curious what you're doing while watching me. So make sure to put in the comment section what you're doing right now, just a tangent. But uh, while you're doing that, you're maybe questioning why isn't Fedi sharing the experiment or the before and after pictures that he's supposedly been receiving for the past three months. Well, the answer to that is really simple and that's because I have received zero before and after pictures. I have received only one and it's not uh, good enough, in my opinion, to share it with you guys. So uh, despite the initial encouragement that I've been finding on the Reddit community, on the customer RNA community, and even I've seen the post on Crestless, uh, despite all of that encouragement, I have received zero follow-up or even initial uh, before pictures uh, that will indicate someone who is willing to participate in this experiment. So uh, that's something that's been unfortunate. I've also said it in the comment section that this experiment that I wanted to initiate was a failure. And there's also one more point that I wanted to emphasize while we're talking about the Cosmo RNA subreddit, and that is I wanted to take this as an opportunity to say how shitty and bad the Cosmo RNA subreddit is. I am not really familiar with the verification process that the moderators require for a user to be a verified buyer of the Cosmo RNA product, but let me tell you this, it is full of new accounts that have no other posts but Cosmo RNA and it makes me uh, feel a little bit suspicious about the legitimacy of those particular accounts even though they are put and uh, indicated as verified buyers. So uh, I'm not really sure about the process of the verification and if some of you maybe the Cosmo RNA moderators know of that please put it in the comment section. So uh, I don't really think this subreddit is providing value to the users of Cosmo RNA. And I've said it time and time, and I just wanted to take this as an opportunity while we're talking about it. I really hate that subreddit. And every time I wanted to give it one more chance and get into it and try to uh, see the real personal anecdotes that the users have and post on there, I find obviously fake accounts, new accounts that have no other posts about Cosmo RNA that have been created, most of them, one year ago or maybe five, six months ago, about the time Cosmo RNA is being marketed to be released into the market. And a lot of them are also Korean. So if you're maybe, uh, I'm not indicating that this has anything to do with race, of course, but I'm just saying if you're Korean and if you're uh, a shareholder of this company, please, you're doing more bad, you're doing more harm than good by uh, promoting your product and uh, punishing criticism of this product on different forums on the internet. Cosmo RNA is obviously being made or have been made with a wonderful technology, SIRNA, which is a brand new technology. So if your product is good as you promote it to be, let us speak for yourself and don't ruin its reputation by doing photoshops. That's one more topic I'm not going to get into in this video or by uh, creating fake accounts and promoting it on the internet. That's doing more harm than good. 
And by that, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Don't forget, I will post the link to the online consultation service on my description on this video. And if you enjoyed the video and found it informative, don't forget to like the video. Also, subscribe if you haven't yet. And as always, stay safe.